my goodness, is this true? Is that how Haji and her crew? They call me How Haji. In these streets, I'm a certified G. Not as in gangster, but rope, don't you see? Yup, 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 that's me. I invite you personally to come see this play featuring me. You know the tagline, it's not easy, it's not easy, it's not easy. I absolutely am so excited that you guys are back and joining our channel. I wanted to show you the many hijabs that I wear in the community. I told you guys one of my favorite pastimes is basketball. We have a league here in Ottawa that operates and happens twice a week every Tuesday and every Thursday right here in the community we have over 40 girls that are registered and absolutely love to participate I'm one of them I am a mother of six I've been playing basketball since I was yay high I don't even know how old I was when I first started but absolutely like um, how Haji was questioning our sister Maria Baller who is a trailblazer for my generation one of the first girls that started you know, showing all the tricks and all of the things you could do with the ball. Absolutely um, grateful for her because there was no girls playing basketball when we first arrived in Canada. This is early 90s I'm talking about. I am aging myself. I know I don't look that old because black don't crack. Like Keith, I'm going to tell you one thing that I know is you've got to get active if you want. Whatever it is, choose whatever exercise you want to do for yourself in your life, whether it's basketball, whether it's yoga, whether it's running. But being physically active is what some of the things like the girls were saying and they're going to tell you is going to help you with your mental health, your physical health, to give you strength, to build your core so you can live and thrive for your family. My name is Habiba Ali. Welcome back to our channel. And now I'm going to show you with the rest of the participants and the founders, uh, organizers, Asia and um, Medina, the twins, will absolutely have to share with you. Thank you. Yeah, so what inspired us to create this basketball program is that there really isn't a lot of spaces for a lot of women, mostly women of color, to actually come together and play ball, you know? Right, right. Um, I joined a league, I guess, um, at Carlton, and I noticed a lot of my friends would want to join because they didn't feel comfortable. It was very intimidating. Yeah, very intimidating because there's a lot of great... I guess very good professional sort of like it was very intense league mm -hmm. and so I asked my friends to come join but they didn't feel comfortable so me and Medina decided to um, have a space so girls can feel more comfortable and they can take their hijabs off and wear whatever they feel like whatever's comfortable for them and that will I at first is very hard like to begin because at first it was like maybe two or three people would show up and then one, one day it would be five but will I we just kind of pushed it through because we knew there was people to actually wanted to come out you know and then we just stuck through it and it's been what like six years seven years seven, now I guess. like yeah, yeah. And, and there's so many girls there's always a wait list now just yeah. for people to just join oh, yeah. yeah which is a uh, what well, it's just amazing for us to see you know um, it's definitely a space that really like it's really needed you know oh, yeah. mm -hmm. what ball means to us um friendship uh, community laughing we laugh yeah. all the time oh, yeah. There's always somebody getting blocked, so you know, you yeah. gotta, you know, inside jokes. Little, you know, you pass it to them a little bit, but you know, it's always fun in games, you know? Right. There's always inside jokes, um, community building, friendship building. A lot, of, a lot of the times, as you know, we're adults now, it's really hard to find friendships with adults, right? right? To find like a community. So it's kind of nice having like an avenue or like a place where you can meet new people, right? Because there's not really a lot of places to meet a lot of women, right? Just that just looks like, like us, right? right? So, yeah. That's what ball means to me. Right, right. Especially with these girls, we've created like a really tight bond. Mm -hmm. Everyone's so friendly with each other, encouraging. Yeah, like even we have people who are not really, um, I guess, comfortable playing ball, but they show up and we encourage them. And we've had some of the people who've never played ball in their life, and now they're like, you know, the underdogs. They're like yeah, one of the best stars. players, you know? And it's that encouragement, you know? There's no such thing as being a horrible player. You know? We just keep pushing each other to kind of better ourselves, right? With the camera, okay, all right. 
Do I go now? Okay. My name is Asha. I've been actually coming to the Ridgemont Basketball since 2017. Religiously speaking, obviously since COVID happened, we weren't able to have that luxury of playing ball with the girls. Obviously everything had to be, you know, COVID requirements and stuff like that. But so far, ever since everything has been lifted, and the girls were able to create this ball and bring it back for us since the summer. I'm actually really, really grateful for that. On top of that, I've been coming, what, 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020? Well, don't count 2020, 2021. So like five years, and I've known Asi and Medina for a very long time, ever since we were like Vincent Massey, like kid years, like young in years, and this, like coming here and playing my heart out and doing the best that I possibly can as a player and as a small woman, small woman, ugh, I can't even, ah, oh, stutter! <laughs> as a Muslim small woman, it has brought me a lot of like strength and courage from playing with them because not only am I able to like express myself in a way physically, but I'm also like to get my mental health in check because obviously not playing and exercising will affect your mental health. So doing this two hours or even four hours, because ball is two hours weekly for now, but it used to be four hours, and even doing that does a great amount of achievements for you guys. So this program, all girls basketball happening solely because of Asi Medina has been tremendous and I'm forever grateful for that. I'm forever grateful. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Canada, as a matter of two and again, I and happy to have a share of a month in a delicious gray month. I die November 16, 2021. We have channel in a delicious gray. Madame Anna Hai, for your mashallah, Tabarakalai, basketball, Naya, Kabdomus in a liar, talk of Ruth, but also Malia, mashallah, Tabarakala, as good Heran Hai, in like 2008, as Layer and Naila had the 2021, and put your no long time away. After Yelden, I put a mashallah, no basketball, Kigayaria, why we have so the eclipse of Sisa, Arinta, Alhamdulillah, Madia, energy of basketball, Kigasina, mashallah, Tabarakala, Ego, the Hago, I see you as my as. Thank you so much, Adi Adba Mahsin Kiwalehe. I know the share base of no he seen, mashallah, sports is gonna work. Basketball ko hoyo yeah hoya la amp in tabaka brodam bu ufi anti sports so dam poka fotasto because of as mat kigeno, jirkeno, mashallah tabarakala u ufi anti mentally because why marka I sports ka yari sit. Second things, Alhamdulillah, Okay, we have a little shirk, Madame and Jugo, and Jim, a lot of people are standing up and dicta, Wakana, Kabahanaga, Somali, Kabahanaga, the Malo, is breaking, Wakana, son of Shake Grenessa, free and alcohol free back at the high, and the son of Spring Green Hakor Hakatabo, Stamalek, Amaku, Senesa, Wahmala, have fun of life again, two pistigo, no for a less, Ahna Watana, Wahesan, El Kahadan, Shampo, the Nimaka, Shampo, the Naga, Halaba, the Wahesan, Mashallah, Kawakala, Alaba, Kuruha, the day Wakana, Ia, and I go, oh, hey, Kalipisan, Wakana, Frantigo. You can't eat it, you'll get what you did. Okay, I'll have a mashallah to work a lot. Oh, you did. Yeah, okay, sir. Just like a lot. Hey, how had you? So I go to have to look at.